Yo, what is up guys? It's your boy Bo, back with yet another banger. We got some BFB Coliseum boost all here, right? So let's hop right into today's video. If you guys are indeed new to the channel, welcome. My name is Boltrix, nice to meet you, all right? We do daily uploads on the channel. I'm telling y'all right now, you're not gonna regret clicking that subscribe button. And why would I drop a like on today's video, okay? We're gonna be absolutely tryharding for today's video. Hopefully use like some different though tryhard strategies uh, because you guys know about the common ones I use like Dart Wiz, Dart Farm Ace, Wiz Tack. Okay, so let's try to switch it up just a tad bit, uh, but still play to our best ability, okay? So it is taking some time to find this game. So I'm gonna catch you guys when we finally do. All right, so we finally found our first about a Goku. Oh my, okay, so if you guys don't know, I am a huge Dragon Ball fan, okay? Well, not like huge, but I am a fan of Dragon Ball. I actually have a canvas in my room. I'll pop up a picture on the screen for y'all right now. It's like Starry Night themed, okay? But it's Goku versus Vegeta. It's freaking sick, man, okay? So I respect the heck out of this guy already. But anyways, offside is going to be the map, okay? So we definitely can try hard on this map. Um, hopefully he's not going in eco strategy because if he is, then eh, but it is only boost only, okay? So yeah, let's just try to switch it up a tad bit. I'm gonna be going Wizard Village Farm, okay? I never use this strategy, like, ever, okay? So let's see how this one works out for us, boys. Let's get it, alright? And like I said, if he is indeed going eco, it's gonna kind of suck, uh, but at least he doesn't have, like, broken powers, okay? We only have the default powers, which is super, super nice, okay? And he's gonna be starting off with the Dart Lane, so I might as well just start off with my Wizard on the map, okay? It's a 100 million percent not going to be worth uh, going for the farm at first because he's already anti-stalling, okay? And what anti-stalling is, is that he's popping the balloons right as they come out the map. Therefore, the round is actually gonna be a lot quicker than it normally should be, okay? Uh, so that kind of is unfortunate, but it is all good. I decided to send him three sets of reds and two sets of space blues, okay? Just to get up my ego a little bit, possibly force an upgrade, okay? Um, he's going to be sending us uh, a lot of ego, actually, okay? Because he knows the wizard is pretty weak um, to round two AI. Of course, as you guys can see, I'm leaking already a crap ton of lives, which is kind of unfortunate, right? But there's nothing we can do about it with starting with the wizard, okay? And um, yeah, I'm not too experienced with starting off with the wizard, okay? Like, I use the wizard all the time. It's just not normally my starting tower um so we leaked almost 50 lives oh my boys this is not too good uh let's get up the lightning of course right freaking now there we go all right so he definitely has a life advantage on us all good though okay not too big of an issue uh, he's gonna be sending us some space pinks here we should be able to fully defend okay but he's not gonna stop so i'm actually set this to last all right never mind okay we're chilling we're chilling i thought for a second he literally was gonna stop uh, but he just did all right so we're gonna go for the plantation he was able to go for it and he's out ecoing us oh my okay so this ain't looking too good uh just because he can really really greed with that dartling all right um so on round six if he does indeed send us some space blacks we're gonna have to do something about that all right we're probably gonna have to get up another uh wizard uh he did upgrade to that power for darts right there okay so i guess i'm not gonna be sending him anything um but yeah i'm not feeling too good so far in this game i'll be honest with y'all uh, like I said, I like never use a strategy, okay? Uh, so this is kind of new to me. Uh, but anyways, gonna go for the more bananas right here. Let's turn on the guided access before I forget. All right. And yeah, we could send him some space blocks within this round seven AI, okay? We're gonna try that because I feel like a single Dartling is not gonna be able to fully defend them. I honestly could be wrong. Let's see exactly, okay? So with the Dartling, there's like a lot of screen lag, so we can't actually know what's happening. Uh, but he did indeed build up another dart lane, okay? So that tells me he did struggle a little bit. Um, therefore, he had to upgrade, okay? So I definitely will take that. Uh, I kind of want to go for the second plantation, but yeah, I kind of figured he was going to be boosting some uh, space region wards on me, okay? So I just got up another um, uh, lightning wizard. I'm going to be good against all of that. Definitely was a go to move, boys, okay? Absolutely. freaking lootly. Uh, so that is okay that he went for that farm. We're going to be going for the plantation here. Okay, so let's get that. I don't know when we should go for the village uh, because, of course, it's going to decrease the cost of our farms as well. Um, so, yeah. Oh, wow. It's kind of a greedier move. Uh, but no, okay, he's going Darling Boomer. All right, so Darling Boomer. Uh, I'm indifferent about the strategy, okay? Because, honestly, if you make it to the late game rounds and you don't have good farms... You're screwed, okay? And also, the Dartling is not that good late game, okay? And especially the Boomer. Not good at all, right? Uh, but we're going to be upgrading to the next farm. So we took the farm lead. They're going to be sending him that camo, of course. 
uh, we can probably get up the monkey sense on there. There we go. Let's put this to first, by the way, okay? And we're also probably just going to get up this um, village right now. We can have it like right here, I guess, okay? Because like I said, it's going to decrease the cost of our farms, which is indeed lovely. Okay, it looks like he's going to all out us. Yeah, okay. So what we're going to do here is this and that boost. All right, I don't think that was an all out. All right, I should not have done that. I think he's still dead, hopefully. Oh my goodness, boys. Holy crap. Okay, so I decided to boost to that rush that he sent us, but I realized it was not an all out. Okay, so that's why I was super, super scared. And he still had money. He sold that boomer though, so I thought he was going to re-rush me instantly. But no, he was baiting me a little bit, but still he was not able to defend what I had to send him. GG's only. I will catch y'all in the next one. All right, so we are back with our next opponent best bmc player okay so bmc is balloons monkey city i personally don't play that game let me know if y'all do in the comments but anyways snowfall is going to be the map okay um so i use ninja sub a lot okay and honestly it's not that good anymore okay with the farms being increased the base price and whatnot it is super super hard during the early game rounds okay you just happen to leak so many lives it sucks okay um it doesn't like suck entirely it just like sucks that you have to leak so many okay so many lives um, but yeah, he's gonna be skipping it. Moon landing is the next map. Okay, so as we all do know, the tax shooter is pretty darn good on this map. Okay, so I think I'm gonna revolve my strategy around that specifically because uh, I'm kind of down for that. Um, so yeah, we're gonna be going tack mortar farm, boys. Oh my goodness, we're bringing back the OG strategies. Let's get it, boys. Okay, so this strategy it's it's good okay don't get me wrong but if we make it late game of course our main popping power tower is indeed the tax shooter and it's not that strong okay unfortunately so uh there's not much we can do about that uh but we'll try our best okay most definitely like i said i wanted to try hard but show you guys some different strategies as well so i'm gonna go for that farm right there let's also go for the banana farmer so i agreed it a little bit because i didn't go for my tax shooter uh, but we ended up being fine against all of the round one balloons, okay? We're also going to be sending him three sets of reds and two sets of space blues. Uh, we need to upgrade our texture ourselves, okay? Uh, so we're just looking for that triple dart upgrade on his side, okay? So I'm probably going to continuously send these space blues until he does indeed upgrade, um, which he should be, okay? So I'm going to go for the more bananas next because he decided to stop sending the eco for whatever reason. And there he finally goes for that triple dart. Okay, wonderful. We get a few lives off him too, which is, I guess, a good thing, okay? Uh, but yeah, we're going to have to go for the 2 3 tax shooter uh, before the end of this round. Actually, we're going to need it for space pinks, okay? So, depending on what he does, yeah, he's going to be sending us some rides right here. So, I'm definitely going to be going for it, all right? Uh, but at the same time, we're going to be sending him some space deco because he's going to have to upgrade to yet another triple dart, okay? Uh, so, let's get this on the map right now because uh, we 100% need it. And there we freaking go, boys. Okay, so honestly, though. His darts kind of going in with the freaking space eco, man. Oh my, the targeting on his darts is actually really, really good. Okay, so uh, well done with that. We are getting a few lives off of him now, though. Uh, so he's starting to chase. So I'm going to continue sending. Um, and if he doesn't want to upgrade, he doesn't want to upgrade. Okay, but yeah, I think continuing. Actually, no, we're, we're going to stop. Okay, we're going to stop because one, I did misclick. And two, um, he started to like not leak lives anymore. Okay, um, so we're going to send him some space blocks on round six. And that will force a triple dart on his side, okay? He can't send us anything to force an upgrade, okay? Because the tax shooter spot, as most of you already do know, um, is really, really good on this map, okay? And I used to hate this map. I'm starting to like it, okay? I, I don't know why. I don't know. Like, <laughs> I normally just would have really, really bad games on this map whenever I'd play it, okay? So, just bad vibes. Uh, but now, it's honestly not too bad, okay? I always do the tax shooter on this map, okay? So, I would encourage you guys to use a tax shooter strategy, okay? Like, WizTac. WizTac is probably... Uh, one of the best strategies for this map um but yeah anyways uh we could send him some space blacks okay and actually yeah let's try to do that okay let's try and see if he does indeed struggle a little bit okay we were able to get up our plantation as well which is super super nice and he's honestly defending against the space blacks pretty nicely uh looks like he did have to upgrade a little bit he did set down a set of spikes too okay so that is nice to see 
Um, and yeah, wow. I'm honestly really shocked too to see that this guy's going with the dart, okay? I like it though. It's unique, okay? We forced the spike pole upgrade on his side by playing a few sets of yellows, okay? So now we got an ego advantage. We have the farm advantage as well. All right, so we are just looking super, super strong. But yeah, dart definitely can be good on this map, okay? He's probably going dart farm ace um, because the ace seems to be a pretty good tower for this map as well. I mean, it definitely could be, okay? Um, but anyways, we're going to go for another plantation. There we go. He's going to have to go for that juggernaut, okay? So we're actually going to be sending him a regen lead, all right? Because they're kind of annoying, you know? Um, and we're going to be going also for uh, this mortar here, okay? So let's do that. All right, and he decided to upgrade a little bit. Okay, we're going to get the Bernie stuff as well. There we go. Yeah, he's kind of prepared for a round 11 rush, okay? So I'm not going to be sending him anything. Let's go for another farm. Maintain the farm lead. Let's also get up the signal flare. There we go, boys. Okay, so I don't know what the best mortar targeting spot would be. Maybe just like right here. I honestly don't know, boys, okay? But, oh my gosh, okay. I'm going to get up the bigger blast as well, just in case. Seems like it's going to be a pain on this map, all right? Because look at that. That camo is already kind of getting through a little bit. Uh, but we're going to be good, all good against that, okay? Wonderful. I'm going to have up a 0-0 zero, zero attack here, like up here, I guess. Let's get another plantation. And uh, we can send him a little bit of a bait rush on round 14. How about that, okay? We're going to send him a few sets of whites, and that's it. Okay, looking just to force some upgrades on his side. That's literally it, okay? And also get up our eco. And look, he upgraded to two spike bolts. That is huge for us, boys, okay? Very, very much so because now we got up our eco a little bit. We forced some upgrades. Therefore, he wasted some money. And now we're up an entire plantation. Let's get it, boys, okay? We are looking so, so solid, okay? Um, so we're probably not going to be going for the BIA in this situation, all right? Um, <laughs> I don't know. Like, it just seems a little bit too risky to do that. He could indeed send us a camo ceramic or just a ceramic in general, right? Uh, so we're going to have to watch out for that. I'm probably just going to get up another texture just in case. All right, I'm playing like kind of safe, like really, really safe, actually. No way he actually just went for that. No freaking way, boys. No way. You have to do something about that, buddy. You have to do something about that, buddy. Oh, that's death. I see death. Let's go! Holy crap, boys. No way. He could have easily won that. He could have just sold his BIA, but he decided to be greedy, and it costed him the game. GG's only. I will catch y'all in the next one. All right, so we are back with the next one, button. NS clicks. All right. So, oh my gosh, guys, that last game was super, super intense because I nearly threw that game. Okay. Honestly, because I boosted the regen rainbow rush and trust me, I know how OP spike bolts are, but my goodness, those literally shredded through all those rainbows. It was ridiculous. And they were also boosted like, oh my, I understand they hit a tower boost as well, but wow, I did not expect that. Okay. Uh, but anyways, Battle Sands of the map, I was about to say, I was going to skip it just because I didn't have enough time to think. Snowy Castle is going to be the next map, okay? Um, so we could go this strategy, all right? Kind of toxic. Um, I don't know what other strategy we could use on this map, you know? Should we just, like, switch it up and, like, meme for the last game? Since this guy doesn't look too good, you know what? We're going to do that, okay? We're going to go the ultimate strategy, boys. Enchi Spike Factory Farm. Let's get it. You guys already know about the strategy. Okay, I've made several videos on this strategy. And honestly, like, dude, I swear it's like unbeatable low key. So <laughs> I'm so excited. Let's get it. And the balloon trap is so good on this map as well because there's only two farm spots. Actually, technically three, but I can't get the third one on mobile. It's super, super hard. Um, so yeah, us collecting the money from the balloon traps over time really helps us out. Okay, extremely. So let's get up the engineer. He's going to also be going with the engineer, right? Um, so that is definitely something to know. We're going to be sending him a little bit of eco right here. Okay. Looking for a nine inch nails upgrade. Some along the lines of that. Okay. We're going to be going for the more bananas as well. So let's just do that. We're going to send space blues until 261 behind all of those reds. There we go. Okay. And we're not going to be upgrading. Okay. He did not send us enough, um, in order to force an upgrade on our side. Uh, so we're just going to be chilling. He's going to be going for the sentry gun. Okay. So I guess I'm going to continue on with the eco because I'm not going to be able to go for the next farm. Okay. Uh, before the end of this round so might as well just continue to eco right because there's only a few farm spots on this map as well so mix eco definitely is the move right here boys okay uh we're not going to be sending him too many blues uh just because he's already kind of prepared a little bit 
Um, but yeah, we're also gonna have to upgrade ourselves, all right? Um, so yeah, let's just send like three sets of blues right here. Let's go for a sentry gun ourselves too. There we go. And he's gonna be all good against all of that, okay? So I'm gonna get up this set to last. And we might leak a few lives, okay? Um, but for the most part, we're gonna be pretty good, okay? So I'm not gonna upgrade anymore. And yeah, we're big chilling boys, okay? So I'm probably just gonna end up selling this to go for a plantation eventually. And yeah, he just went for his, okay? Understandable, we have an eco advantage, okay? So that is all good with me. Let's sell this, yeah. Go for the plantation. There we go, boys. And hmm, we could send him space blacks, but not until round seven, okay? Um, but let's see what he does at us, okay? He could send us some space blacks, and yeah, he's gonna do that immediately, actually, all right? Uh, so should we greed right here? I think so. I'm gonna greed because, yeah, he just went for his as well. Therefore, he doesn't even have any money to send us any space blacks, okay? So we're big chilling right now. There we go. That definitely was a go to, okay? One million percent. Uh, we still ended up leaking like a life or two, but it's fine, okay? It's a, it's really, really fine, okay? So yeah, let's start to send him the Space Blacks within the round seven AI, and let's see how he reacts, okay? Uh, he's also gonna be sending us some as well. Uh, so what I'm gonna do is get this Nine Inch Nails, and we should be pretty good, okay? It's targeted to last, and it looks like he's gonna start leaking some lives. Um, I could be wrong, but on my screen, I see lives being leaked. And yes, he did indeed leak a few lives. Okay, let's get it, boys. All right, definitely not going to be sending him any yellows. I'm going to also stop with the space blacks, okay, because I'm kind of doing a greedy play right here. All right, normally after round eight, I would not go for any more farms because I need enough money to go for the balloon trap on round 10. Um, but since he's also going with the engineer, I highly doubt he's going to be rushing us on round 10 with anything. Um, so yeah, we should be fine. All right. Uh, but anyways, we can get up this um, engineer up in the corner, like right here. Okay, let's start to upgrade it. So there we go. Okay, so we need about $2,800 more, all right? Uh, so we're going to be fine against those leads, all right? All good with those. And yeah, I'm, I'm about to start selling these. Okay, that lead got through. That's fine. That's fine, okay? I'll just, I'll just tank that, I guess. He sent us a lot of leads, though. Oh, we could tack it as well. Okay, yeah, let's just sit down. So tax in the back of the map. There we freaking go, ladies and gentlemen, all right. We're gonna end up being good against all of that. And I next wanna go for a Republic, okay? And yeah, he's going Ninja NG, the broken strategy. We're going with a non-broken strategy, okay? We're memeing a little bit. Uh, this guy didn't look too good though. So hopefully we can somehow still win. I went for the Republic right there, which is kind of a greedy move. So hopefully he is not upset about that, but I should get a, a spike of pulse, or not spike of pulse, <laughs> spike factor in the back of the map just in case. And yeah, he's giving me a thumbs up. I appreciate it. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, we could have sent him a rush. We could have. Uh, it's a little bit too late now. I'm going to probably go for the Republic first. And then on round uh, 15, we'll start to rush him with some Camel Leads. Yeah, we'll do that, okay? We'll send him some like Camel Reds at first and then some Camel Leads, okay? How about that? Because normally when I go with the Engineer, that's what people do, okay? So it must be a pretty darn good move. Let's also upgrade uh, the Spike Factory in the back of the map a little bit, okay? And yeah, let's start to send him the Reds. And then we're going to start to send the Camos. Okay, hopefully they do indeed get through. Looks like, yeah, they did. Okay, cool. They got through, all right. So that's going to force an upgrade on his side. Uh, we could also just send him like pinks and stuff because it looks like he's scared. Um, oh my gosh, that must just be screen lag, man. No way, boys. We just got debated. Screw this game, man. <laughs> like what? We literally just saw so many camel leads get through, but it's just screen lag. Fix the game, NK. What even? Like, if it doesn't show that, then I don't rush him, you know what I mean? Like, so that kind of just screwed us a little bit, but it's okay. Um, so, yeah, we're kind of screwed since he's going the same strategy, yet he's just going with the uh, ninja. Because, you know, the ninja is just a better tower than the spike factory, okay? Unfortunately, I have to admit it. <laughs> but yeah, he's probably going to be sending us a BFB, or I mean a Moab here. So yeah, here he comes with that. Uh, we're probably just going to spike storm this, okay? Yeah, let's spike storm. It's, it's just not even worth not even worth it boys okay um i guess i didn't pop it okay we still have somehow defended though let's go <laughs> all right so let's go for this republic again really really unfortunate that we had to do that okay i need to go for this yeah let's do that that is that is so so unfortunate man so unbelievably unfortunate like i can't do anything man the fact that he's going with this now, I, I think we should be able to defend against this though, okay? I'm gonna go for probably another spike factory though really quickly. Let's just like get it up, you know? It will help us out a little bit. We also have two sets of attacks, okay? Should, so that should be able to pop it, okay? With ease, 
with that many spike balls in the back yeah we're gonna be good against all of that wonder freaking full okay so i kind of don't want to deplete my eco he's going for another balloon trap so i probably should do the same right yeah you know the double balloon trap will probably be pretty good for us okay so yeah definitely the go-to right here at least he depleted his eco a little bit you know that's a good thing uh, but I guess we'll just wait until like round 22 to rush him might catch him off guard might get a boost out of him You never know um, But yeah, he's probably gonna be going for Something soon since the spike factory is like so expensive to upgrade. Yeah, he's got to be going for a facility soon Okay. Oh, he just decided to upgrade to a sabo Interesting. Okay. I hope he all outs me like honestly that that would be absolutely amazing I don't know why he uses sabo. It's a little bit strange uh, but yeah, let's go for the facility here. Okay, we got to make a play right here, boys. Most freaking definitely. He said destroy, okay? So now I'm a little bit nervous. Uh, but yeah, let's start to send him like camo leads or something. You know, they might get through. Um, so yeah, I'm just looking for an upgrade, really. And I think they got through. Come on, tell me those got through. Yeah, okay, there we go. We forced an upgrade on his side. Let's get it. Um, <laughs> holy. That actually looked pretty bad for a second, too. I mean, like, look at his screen, but it's probably just screen lag. It's gotta be. Makes no other sense. Okay, so yeah, he went for the facility. I went for my facility. We got an ego advantage, all right? Uh, so we're looking pretty strong. Um, and I guess we're both probably just gonna send each other, like, space OMG. I hope he just sends me space OMGs and I just fully defend, okay? Because, like, I'm down to do that. If he throws his game while going Ninja NG, that would be hilarious. Okay, balloon boost. Yeah, he's going to be uh, sending us this. Okay, so we're going to sell this. Uh, sell this as well. Go for the spike storm. Okay. And we're actually going to have to sell this as well. I can't set these anywhere. No! Oh my gosh, man. We can't even defend against a single ZOMG. So we're back with the next one, NX Clicks, okay? So I just went against this guy, and he goes Ninja NG, and I went NG Spike Factory, okay? Which honestly is my fault, all right? I should not have went that strategy because I said I wanted to try hard, and yeah, he just went Ninja NG, okay, when I broke a strategy and won. <laughs> I mean, I'm trying to meme, you know? He's gonna win. Uh, but anyways, yeah, he's not good, okay? I'm telling y'all right now, no offense, he's just not that good, and I know he wants another Ninja NG map, okay? So we're not gonna let that happen. Inlets is a Ninja NG map. We're skipping that. If it's a Ninja NG map, I'm leaving, okay? Battle Sands is not a Ninja NG map. Let's get it, okay? So Dart Wiz, I'm sorry, boys. I know we always go this, but I gotta beat this guy, okay? Because he was kind of being cocky towards me while I'm memeing, so we just gotta absolutely destroy this kid during this game. Let's freaking get it right now, okay? We're gonna be starting off with our farm as actually our dart, okay? We're able to do that, forgot, um, and let's see what he's going. If he's going Ninja NG, that would be hilarious. Absolutely hilarious. No, he's going with the dart, okay? We're gonna absolutely freaking destroy this kid, okay? I'm calling it right now. Let's get up to zero one one actually. I'm gonna be sending him a lot of mixed eco here, boys, okay? A lot indeed, and it looks like he's gonna be doing the same thing, okay? Uh, so what we need to do is send Space Blues until 261 behind those reds. He's not going to be liking that. Uh, we're also going to go for the... Actually, no. No triple dart here. No triple dart indeed, boys. Okay, we're able to go for the uh, more bananas on our farm as well, which is super, super nice. We're going to continue on with this eco as well. And I don't know why he's crying at me, okay? Because I can afford to leak 25 lives. It's all good with me. It don't matter, boys, okay? Uh, but yeah, mix ego on this map definitely is a go-to option. You should always mix ego on this map, okay? Because uh, it's very, very effective. And he still can't even go... Uh, for his next farm okay so yeah it you just need to mix eco but anyways yeah let's put this to last let's send it, start to send him some space pinks and let's also do that there we go boys and he's probably gonna have to upgrade his dart hopefully okay i'm probably not gonna do anything on my screen and yeah he decided to upgrade to another triple dart and he's down to 95 thank you thank you for saying well done i appreciate that this guy is probably the guy to straight up sell his trip dart too okay i could totally see it uh, but so far so good we're literally tied in the farms and i have such a huge eco advantage on him okay so we are out playing this kid so far let's get it okay he should be sending me space blocks immediately and yep here he comes at those or with those i mean okay so that's going to be easy to defend let's put this back on the first by the way okay because uh, we kind of don't need on the last anymore and we're about to go for another plantation all right so he's a little bit ahead it's understandable okay because 
I have an eco advantage. I'm going to catch back up over time. Okay, so it's all good in the hood with me. We're going to start to send him some space blocks as well because he's not going to be able to go for a plantation or anything like that. Uh, so it's all good. Okay, he's going to be sending me quite a bit of greens though. Holy. Uh, we're going to end up being good against all of those. We're going to leak a few lives though. Uh, but he is also two as well. So it don't even matter. It don't even matter, boys. He's actually going to leak down like pretty darn low because he didn't upgrade at all. Yikes, boys. What are you doing? What are you doing? Oh, my goodness. Oh, that's not good. Okay, we're obviously going to send him yellows here. And there he goes with the spike of Pod, okay? Uh, so he's going to be able to defend. But we got him down so low. 56, 55. This man is just leaking left and right. Let's get it, boys. Okay, so the next move, of course, is to go for this plantation. And I was about to say, he's going to send me yellows. I most definitely saw that coming, okay? I can read this guy like a dang book, man, okay? Uh, but anyways, let's sell this. Let's go for that. Wonder freaking full. And I wonder if he's going with the wizard, okay? I kind of would be shocked if he wasn't, but there is a possibility, okay? But we were able to go for that farm. There we go. Because uh, we can still go for this wizard here, okay? So let's put that on strong very quickly. And yeah, he's not going. Oh my gosh. He's not going with that. That is that is really unfortunate, okay? We're going to send him the small round 11 rush, of course. He's not going to be liking that, all right? And oh my gosh, dude. His juggernaut spot is not in a good spot. Oh my gosh. He has to use all sets of his tacks to barely survive. Nope, he dies. This, I told you. Oh my god. This kid is so freaking bad. Oh my goodness, get out of here. Yeah, yeah, go ahead and face palm. <laughs> we freaking won that with these boys. Let's get it, okay? So now that we beat him, I guess I'll include the last game, all right? Uh, but ZOMGs, man, it is so hard to defend against a single ZOMG with the spike factory, okay? Like, I had to spike storm literally like eight times, it feels like. So I'm just depleting my money so much, it's crazy. Uh, but yeah, we ended up losing that game. I'll show it now. Uh, but anyways, make sure to drop a like and click that subscribe button if you guys didn't enjoy okay? Because that's going to wrap up today's video. So the last question I asked you guys in the last video was, what was the broken fourth that our opponent used in yesterday's video, all right? And the answer is the boomer, all right? So this guy won. Congratulations, man. All right, I have a lot of comments. A lot of comments saying, why didn't you use your fourth? If you guys don't know, I always preach this. Don't use your forts, okay? You can't rely off your forts. You can't rely off your forts. You can't rely off your forts. It's a luck to base tower, okay, boys? And honestly, too, it's a sign of respect to just not use your fort. I understand it's just a game, okay? Um, but yeah, I could have easily used the village myself, uh, but I decided not to because I don't ever use my fort. It's just a sign of respect. I just don't do it, all right? Um, and this guy, he won the game because he had Boomer, all right? And some people are like, oh, he only used the Boomer one time to defend... Literally, if he didn't have the boomer right there, he was dead. And also, during the mid-game rounds, he decided to use the boomer, okay? Um, so that saved his life during the mid-game rounds and the late-game rounds. So it just essentially was not fair, all right? And that's why they're luck-based towers and need to be removed from the game. And that's exactly why in BFB Coliseum Boost only in today's video, we did not have forts, okay? Because they're broken. Anyways, congrats on the shout-out, all right? So the next question. I'm going to be asking you guys this. What round did we just kill our last opponent on, all right? Make sure to leave your answers down below in the comment section, all right? And you may have the chance to win a shout-out in the next video, which is obviously dope. I hope you boys did enjoy. Once again, it's been your Bobo Tricks or Justin. Peace out, everybody.